Welcome back to my channel guys. It's your girl Coco Styles and on this channel we talk about beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. But in today's video I'm going to show you two products, well three products that I have been using for the last month since my hydro, hydro, um, my hydro facial. Uh, so I'm just going to jump right into it. This is going to be really quick. And the first thing is the Eminence. I hope you guys can see. Come on. Can you guys see that? Yes. Okay, so that's this is the brand is Eminence. It's an organic skincare routine, and they've pretty much been around since 1958. And the products are made in Hungary, so Hungary. <laughs> um, so this is the toning um, misting spray. It's called Stone Crop Hydrating Mist, and I have been using this for the last month. You only need a small, small amount of this this product. And I, I love it. So they have different, there's one more type, I believe. But I got the, uh, I guess the green tea one. Um, the products are organic, guys. And you guys know that I'm really big on my skin and breakouts and stuff. So I haven't had any issues with this product. So I would recommend this, at least trying it out. It is a little pricey. I think it's like 38 bucks, but I'll link everything below for you guys. And it's for normal to dry skin. I like it a lot. And I'm not, I'm a person who has used Neutrogena for ever. <laughs> Never had any issues with it, but I've noticed lately that my skin has been a little bit dry with my moisturizer that I use at night. Um, and the reason why I use a different one is because I have two. I use two different ones. So I just got a new box of this stuff here. And this is the, I don't know, can you? It's so bright, guys. All right. So this is the Camellia Glow Solid Face Oil. Oh my goodness, guys. <sighs> Listen, I love this. I love this, I love, you only need a small, small amount. So, small amount. Um, and this is the bottle. It's not a huge bottle, it's bigger than, it's probably the size of two Carmex things together. And the smell is not the best smell, however, you only need a tiny, tiny, tiny bit of this. And I'll tell you guys, listen, I still feel like my skin is getting better as far as the dryness. It doesn't look dry, but it feels dry in some areas. So I've been also using this. It also comes with like, A little scooper <laughs> if you don't want to stick your fingers in it which may be better to actually use this anyway for germs and bacteria and stuff so that's that <clears throat> and then I also have a moisturizer that I like a lot and like I said I think my Neutrogena visibly visibly even was drying out my skin or Maybe it's because when I was on vacation, I wasn't drinking a lot of water. Because you guys know I have a certain type of water that I drink. And this is um, the other one. And I didn't have that in Florida. And this is the Calm Skin Chamomile Moisturizer. Whew, listen, with the two of these together. Because this dried right up on my skin. So I knew that my skin was dehydrated. Um, this on top of it, and then you could even spray this as another step, or you can use some other rose water spray, and your skin is going to feel great. It didn't feel tacky or anything to me, um, so I would recommend if you do try either of these either of these products, um, that you should see if see if you like the way your skin feels. It, it was okay for me. Now I'm not going to lie; these are not cheap. Well. Uh, personally, I think if, you, if you've if you been using the same product for some years, your skin can actually get used to it. I think that's with anything. 
I mean, I think that's what's happening with the Neutrogena, uh, the moisturizer. I don't think it's working. And also, the SPF is in it. So I got like a little sample, um, a little sample SPF by itself. Can you guys see that? It's so small. First of all, I pay eight dollars for this. I don't even know why, but <laughs> I wanted to try it out. But I do think that they should be separate. Um, I don't know. I just feel like the product will work better. So for the chamomile, the Calm Skin Chamomile Moisturizer, that was seventy six dollars, guys. It, it's a, it's a little pricey. How I like it though a lot. You only need a when I say a small amount. Even like my Bobbi Brown, um, what is this? My Bobbi Brown Primer. I think it's like 60 bucks, I think. But I only need a tiny, tiny bit. So when it is time for me to replace it, it's not going to feel like, oh my God, I just purchased this thing for 60 bucks. And then the the Chamomile Glow Solid Oil. Um, Actually, hold on. No, the Calm... The Chamomile Calm Skin, that's 59 It's the, the Camellia Glow Solid Oil, that's 76 That's this one. <laughs> the smaller one. This one is 76 Alright, um, all right, guys, so here's the product. I totally went all over the place. This one is in a bigger, uh, a bigger container jar, and it also still comes with the little scooper. And this is the jar for this one. Okay, and let me open this up for you guys. I like the way this smells, and it's like a yellowish, yellowish color. Can you guys see? Mm, yeah, it's yellow. So I have seen this stuff on Amazon and stuff like that, but I'm not gonna lie, guys, I wouldn't even trust it. I wouldn't. I would want to make sure that I'm getting exactly what I ask for. Um, <clears throat> so, like I said, this is an organic product. Uh, you guys can look this up and find out anything. This is a 60, it's a two, two fluid ounce, which is a moisturizer, and then the Camellia oil, solid oil, one fluid ounce. But you literally only need a little bit, guys. So, let me know what you guys think about it. And I do have it on today. And what I do notice, I haven't really been like hanging. When I was in Florida, I didn't take the stuff with me. But what I have noticed is that today I literally just only have on concealer. Uh, just a little bit of concealer and I have on a little bit of powder here. That's it. <laughs> but I think for me, my skin still feels moist and it looks moist to me, not greasy. So, like I said, if this is too much for you guys, then still stick with the Neutrogena. I just think that for my skin, that at the times are... I'm 41 now, so maybe that's what it is. But I felt really dry. Um, but like I said, I have not been drinking water the, the weeks that I was on vacation. Not enough water. So that could have been it too. So I'm going to end up probably purchasing another bottle of this, the SPF separate. Um, I wanted to just try it out and I like it a lot. So these are my three products that I have from this brand. And actually you say four because we can include the SPF in. That's it guys. <laughs> this is my thumbnail. <laughs> yeah guys, so that's it. Let me know what you guys think. If you have any questions on it, let me know. Um, and again, they've been around since 1958. That's what I was concerned about. I didn't want anything new. Um, and I couldn't find it again. So that's it, guys. If you like more videos like this and quick little reviews, let me know. I would do plenty, plenty more for you guys. And if you stay to the end of this video, please comment, Coco, we see you. And don't forget to hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next one. And please don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco underscore styles underscore NY. And I will see you guys until next time. Bye.